it's just a wonderful building and it's lovely to see it so well restored. And I had no idea that John Gay was educated here um, because I have an interest in music. And so uh, the opera and the connection with John Gay and Benjamin Britten is all very relevant. So. Mm -hmm. What's the most interesting fact you've learned today? Uh, I think it's history and how far it goes back. I mean, you wouldn't, looking at the outside, you wouldn't believe it's actually this old. I enjoyed all of it, really. It's a lot more spacious than we thought and a lot of history. Um, do you know any interesting facts that you've learned? Um, John Gay went to school here. Um, well, we didn't even know it was a school, did we, clearly? But we've looked at all the little drawings on the old desks. It's been a nice visit. We've had a very interesting talk about how the fact it was a chantry chapel, uh, where rich people paid for prayers for their souls after they were dead, and that it um, became a chapel that was used by the Huguenots when they fled to uh, Devon from France. Brilliant. It's a great place for people to meet and nice to see one of these uh, old buildings being used with, with so many different age groups. Have you learned anything new today? Yes, I have. I was quite interested in the Huguenots that uh, arrived in North Devon. I was interested in the Huguenots to a, just a curiosity point of view. Um, so it was quite informative as to contribution that Huguenots made. Hey, yeah. well, we come to Barcelona to do our shopping. So for why not coming in and have a look around? It's a beautiful building. Well, I've uh, had a very interesting talk with some of the people that actually look after the, 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 the building. I've learnt a lot about the history of the site. Um, and it makes me very proud to be a Barnstable boy. Uh, we come to see what's going on at the workshop as it's Heritage Day today, hence yeah, dress like this. You're working in the Heritage Centre. And I'm working in the Heritage Centre. Are there any particular features of this building that stand out to you? The roof. The roof I yeah. love the roof and the period of it. Well, it's got a, a roof which is typical of the time, um, a kind of ha not a hammer beam, scissor beam construction, as far as I can see. Um, but I'm just interested why Sindan, because to my knowledge, uh, she was the Virgin Mary's mother, and she's not in the Bible. But she is, I believe, the patron saint of wells and springs, for example. So I haven't found out yet why it is sent down. Mm. What's the most I've seen on some of the uh, the ins and outs of it? You know, like the holes in the wall, all part of the construction in early days, wasn't it? Going back, yeah. marvelous, really. Okay. What so. was interesting to note was the, uh, the the roof actually yeah. built by a, a chap who's a wheelwright, a uh, shipwright, Ship. and yeah. like a the keel of a boat. You can look, see that boat up the top there. Yeah. Um, ah, I enjoyed the, the welcoming uh, information as yes. well. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And it's, it's so interesting to see some of these old things. I'm not very much into history, to be honest, but something like this grabbed me a bit, you know. Mm. Yeah, it's funny, isn't it? And it's such a wonderful oasis in the middle of Barnstable, and that contrast between busy Boutport Street and Butcher's Row and this oasis of tranquility was always something great to draw and bring the students down to work. So, um, what did you most enjoy about your visit? Um, I think the reading really, apart from all that you can see, I like the carvings on the desks, but all the information really. Um, just you don't really know unless you read them. Uh, just thinking of children mm. here, you know, just thinking of the history of the children here. I think what I, I like about this place is to see it used and restored and, and living again and being able to see around the beautiful structure. So that's what I really have enjoyed. Anything else you'd like to add? I think it's well worth a visit and I'd come again. Oh, great. Thank you.